Poppin' everybody, it's your boy Gunther Great. Welcome back to the vlog, man. I'm chilling here at Candace's. I actually shot two Gunslock videos here. Uh, I'm uploading one tonight, which is yesterday. Go check it out. And I also set up these trees behind me because that's cool, you know. But I got a lot of cool stuff in store for you guys. So stay tuned to the end of the video. Like the video, subscribe if you guys haven't already. What's the deal? This is what you do when you serve. Oh, that's the cover. It's the cover. Oh, that's the cover. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, you can make it in a shirt. You bought that action. Hey, how are you? How are you? You gave up on us. That's okay. You were like, yay, you're done. I'm like, no, girl, he cheated. Yeah. <laughs> I don't give up. I got, I got better things to do. Because <laughs> he was just on, he only did day one. Man. And then so he rude. said, he's like, I'm done with this nonsense, day seven out of seven. <laughs> <laughs> and then he like, tag nobody. I was like, tag nobody. And then you're lucky I tag one of y'all. <laughs> <laughs> It's like I got time, but I ain't trying to use it. Exactly. For that. See, Pastor always says the hardest thing that you can get back is time. So. There you go, huh? <laughs> <laughs> it's not the flag as bad. Too, I'm like, she you got it on here, girl? Right? <laughs> no, I'm like, huh? Let's see if I can see. In chapter 12, in verse 1, it says, therefore I urge you, brothers and sisters, in view of God's mercy, to offer yourselves as a living sacrifice, holy and pleasing to God, which is your true and proper worship. Hey guys, so guess what? We just got our test. Oh, Chase got a 98. Good job, Chase. Candace got a Candace, by the way, if you didn't know. A 97. Why, you ask? Because she was trying to skip some lines to be perfect. Then when she got to the next page, she totally just went to the next question and didn't write the last answer. But it's okay, because I know this love. Agape. It's God type of love. Anyways, we passed our test. And Chase didn't even have notes to do his test, and he got a better grade than me. High five, Chase. <laughs> <laughs> but yo, oh snap, I feel like I'm in high school. Just finished up class. I think me and Cash are gonna go eat. That's the plan. Back in school. I don't look at this as school, I look at it as classes. That's why I'm always excited, man. I'm excited. Dun dun dun. I'm gonna just stand there for a minute, 15. Got that little freebie. Yeah. Sam, you forgot to open the door? Nope. What's up? What's that? Hello. Do your best dance move. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> I always wow. tell people to do the best dance move. You froze us? I do. Okay. You guys have the time. Yeah, we don't want to come on blast. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Good night, Hakeem. Okay. <laughs> hey, guys. Bye. El Pollo Loco. Oh, yeah. Sauce. Real sauce. Boom. You don't know. Guac. Tortillas. Chips. Chips. Napkins, spoons and forks, taco bean cheese for you. Yummy. We're trying to merc this food right after class. Yo, I'm hungry. So I'll see you guys like after I'm done eating. So show your man some respect and let me eat, man. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But to tell you the truth, I'm, it's time to eat. You ready? Me? I'm ready. We're ready. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 
you know how it is. Yeah, he did the yard work on it, didn't you? Oh, yeah, put the spring. Well, thank you. You mean the guy that's... Oh, I'm tired. I was in Starbucks and I literally didn't do any work. I was just doing downloads. Reason being is because internet speed, I mean, it's fine at the apartment, but then there's dropouts and then dropouts during downloads, you have to restart the download every time. So Starbucks has more of a dependable Wi-Fi when it comes to internet, whatever. Now, until I get a house or until I get Wi-Fi that I'm just using, it's different. That's a whole other story, but what I want to talk about right now, I know yesterday I went to class, I kind of filmed that mostly. I never really explained why I'm going to class or what's the point or why did I drop out of college and now I'm going back into classes. And it's a whole different ballpark, whole different thing. And also, one thing I was doing right now, me and Kenneth were working on this website for our wedding, and I was typing this thing about Nate. I referenced a little bit about when I met him in college and how uh, he was a help in college and stuff like that. And it did make me think a bit. I'm like, yo, why did I drop out of college? And first and foremost, like, yo, I didn't like college. Before I even went to college, I really didn't even want to go to school. I didn't want to go to classes. I just wanted to move. I wanted to get out of my parents' house. And that's what I did. And then when classes came, it was like, it was cool, but then it wasn't cool. And then and I just made the decision after moving to Phoenix, after transferring out, I was like, yo, this isn't for me. And I don't say that from a standpoint like people would be like, college isn't for me. Because college can be for anybody. College can not be for anybody. It's your choice. I'm not going to sit here and tell you that college wasn't for me. It was just a decision I made based not on the circumstance, but based on what I knew. Yeah, if you know, I don't know. You should just know. Be led to go to school or not to go to school. But coming to church and then my pastor, my spiritual father telling me that I need, if you guys understand this or have any understanding whatsoever, when you have a spiritual father, you got to look at it like this. When you go to church, you have to have faith and understand that your pastor or your spiritual father, if he is your spiritual father, if you trust and believe in the word that he's saying or you trust and believe in the word itself, you have to understand that he goes to God gets answers comes back to you gives you the answers and provides for you and he guides the people in the congregation it's pretty much his job and if you have any bible understanding whatsoever you would understand that but when he told me that i uh i should take these classes like that's him telling me like yo you need this in order for you to get to where you're gonna go and i understand that like god knows where i'm going god has revealed to my pastor where i'm going in the future a little bit about my future you know and then i want to have faith in that i want to believe in what he's telling me so why am i going to classes because i believe it's in the will of god for my life in order to get me from point a to point b in the most efficient way possible so that's why i'm going back to classes do i enjoy these classes yes i don't look at it as school i don't look at it as college i look at it as learning more about like literally i love going to class mostly because it's at the church and they have a whole school at the church and i love it it's awesome but i'm like coffee wasted right now you know you're tired and then you drink coffee to try to revive you it's like a double i don't know i'm about to head home right now i didn't do like i said i didn't do any work here i was just doing downloads and just kind of doing stuff on the side but now i'm gonna head home i have to edit the vlog edit a great music video edit a guns locked video and then edit a video that i'm doing for somebody and that is the life of an editor y'all <laughs> with all that being said i'm just gonna cap this video right here hopefully you guys did enjoy if you guys did give it a thumbs up other than that i'll see you guys tomorrow hopefully you guys have an amazing day matter of fact have a great day peace out and god bless